Hey everybody, welcome back to another video de Amigos Ingleses. I hope you are well. In today's class, vamos a aprender la pronunciación de los nombres de algunos famosos. Y en este video hemos colaborado con Cambly. ¿Aún no conoces Cambly? Pues es una plataforma increíble que conecta a estudiantes de inglés con profesores de todo el mundo y puedes conectar instantáneamente. Es como tener un profe en tu bolsillo, básicamente. Y con el código Amigos Ingleses 2019 puedes conseguir 20 minutos completamente gratis con cualquier profesor en la plataforma. Y quédate hasta el final del vídeo porque vamos a sortear una clase de una hora. Una hora hablando en inglés con cualquier profe en la plataforma. Hello. Hi, yes. Can you send her in now? Yeah, we're ready for her. Hello there. Hi. Hi, everyone. You're going to test my grammar? No, not grammar. No, it's pronunciation grammar? today. Okay? Oh, oh okay. Yes. ¿Cómo funciona este juego entonces, Philip? So, I'm going to give you two clues. And after those two clues, you have to tell me who am I talking about, okay? All right, yeah. And if you're not sure, you've got three lifelines. You can ask the audience. You can have an extra clue or you can call a friend. Mm -hmm. Okay, the first person, first clue. She wanted to be a ballerina, but she was too tall. Ooh. Okay. Clue number two. Her wedding dress was record breaking. Oh. Because it was very long. Uh, okay, is that it? That's it. So, who am I talking about? Okay. Do you know? Well, is she, or oh, I mean, was she British? Yes, she was British. And did she marry? Prince Charles that day? Well done, yes. Okay, so we're talking about the Queen of Hearts. The Queen of Hearts. In Spain we say Lady D. Sorry, if you said Lady D, don't think they'd understand you in the UK. It's pronounced Lady Di. Lady Di, because her name was Diana. Lady Diana, Lady Di. Right. Okay, he's an actor, rapper and comedian. And he speaks Spanish fluently. Ooh, okay, uh, I've got no idea. Do you know? Uh, I think I'm gonna use one of your cards. Is right, I want the extra clue, please. Extra clue? Extra clue, okay. He's also known as the F Principe Fresco. <laughs> Fresh Prince, vale. Bueno, ya, esto ya nos lo has puesto a huevo, hombre. This is Will Smith. Will Smith. Cuidado, not S. Smith. Smith. Will Smith. Let's hear you. Will Smith. Okay, next famous person. She's a British actress, but she was born in Paris. She was 10 when she started filming her first film. I'll give you another clue, Isabel. Yes, Emma Watson. <laughs> Emma Watson. It's, it's pronounced Emma Watson. Emma Watson. She's got the loveliest British accent after Mr. Bartlett. Thank you. Ah, and what's the name of the guy who wears the glasses? Harry Potter. Harry Potter. So not Harry Potter. Not Harry, Harry Potter. Potter. Harry Potter. Repeat it. Harry Potter. Isabel? Har Harry Potter. Again? Harry Potter. Fire away, Mr. Bartlett. Okay. Next, he started filming when he was four years old. Oh my goodness. And his film is always on at Christmas time. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Christmas it's not that one. <laughs> okay, one question. Uh, was he usually home alone at Christmas? Or at least in that movie? Macaulay Culkin. Toma ya. <laughs> It's, this is a tough one, but it's Macaulay Culkin. Macaulay Culkin. Macaulay Culkin. Macaulay Culkin. Yeah? Okay, cool. Are you going to watch Home Alone this Christmas? Or of course. are you too old for Every that? Every Christmas. Every <laughs> Christmas. Ah! <laughs> Rocking around. Ah, uh, yeah. 
The Christmas tree, have a happy holiday. Ba -ba -na -ba -na. She's an actress, a singer, and a businesswoman. She was married to one of the most famous British frontmen. A frontman, you know what that is? Mm-hmm. Como el cantante, ¿no? Del grupo. The yes. lead singer. Yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, how many amazing British bands are there? Lots. Do you want right. to ask the audience? I think I'm going to need one of those. I'm yeah? going to call a Cambridge teacher because my friends are not going to know. I'm going to call Jen from... Well, she's, uh, she's British, so she should know. Connecting. Hello. Hello. I'm here with Philip. We're Hello. recording a, a video. We're playing oh, a game, really? guessing celebrity names. Would sure. you be up for okay. it? No problem. Yeah? yeah? Yes, okay. yes, absolutely. Where are you from in England? I'm from the south of England. I'm from a place called Chichester. Okay, yeah. this lady, uh, she's an actress, a singer and a businesswoman. And she was married to a very, very famous lead singer in a British band. But I don't know who she is. I think she's blonde yeah. as well. Gwyneth Paltrow. Correct. Oh, Yay! you're much better than me. <laughs> I'm terrible she's, at this game. She's married to um, a singer called Chris Martin. He is the lead singer of a band called Coldplay. Coldplay, yeah. So we usually say Gwyneth Paltrow. Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah. So how do you say it again, the name? Gwyneth Paltrow. Gwyneth Paltrow. Gwyneth. Wow. And where Gwyneth is she from? Paltrow. Gwyneth Paltrow. I think she's from the States. She's American. Yeah. But mm. I'm I'm not sure I'm not sure which part, but um she has a pretty standard American accent. So maybe yeah. the north, the north of America, the northwest. Thank you so much. Bye. Have fun. Have Bye. Have a good morning. <laughs> right, I'm kind of getting into this now. You're doing well, Isabel. Okay, next. He's a Scientologist and a certified pilot. That's too easy. Really? Yeah. Is he a really short man? I think he's about five foot. Clue number two. He does his own stunts. Stunts? A stunt is when an actor does his or her own dangerous activities in a film. I know, you know, in Spain we say Tom Cruise. Tom Crucero. <laughs> Tom Cruise. Cruise with the Z sound at the end. Tom Cruise. Okay, Tom Cruise. What's your favorite Tom Cruise film, Isabel? None. Oh, you're not a fan? No, I don't like him. Isabel doesn't like action <laughs> films. <laughs> Sorry. He's an actor, writer, director, and producer born in New York. Woody Allen. No. Okay. He's very strong. Oh, I think I know. Is he into boxing by any chance? Yes. Sylvester Stallone. No, 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 no. We say Sylvester Stallone. Sylvester Stallone. Sylvester Stallone. Yes. She's got blonde hair, blue eyes, and she's very tall and slim. Claudia Schiffer? No. She has worked with Quentin Tarantino. She's not always blonde, though, is she? Not always, no. Depending on the film? <laughs> wow, Mr. Ballet! <laughs> You'll be a woman soon. ¿Cómo se pronuncia su nombre? Yo he oído siempre a todo el mundo decir Urma Thurman. Urma, pero no hay una R allí. Se dice Uma. Uma Thurman. Uma Thurman. Uma Thurman. So she was in Kill Bill and, of course, Pulp Fiction. Crazy film. Uma Thurman. Uma Thurman. Uma Thurman. Right, do we have one more? We've got a couple more. Woo! He's an actor who has worked with Tim Burton. Clue number two, he's the most famous pirate in the whole world. Oh, okay, I know. There was a film in which he used to have scissor hands. That's right. Edward Scissorhands. Edward Scissorhands. Casi todo el mundo dice Johnny Deep. Johnny Profundo. No es Johnny Profundo. <laughs> Se dice Johnny Depp. 
Johnny Depp. Ya, yeah, y la verdad que no sé por qué lo leemos Deep, porque no tiene doble E. No. All right, cool. Johnny Depp. Great actor. Okay, last question. He's an extremely funny man. Original... Mr. Barlett. No, not me. Oh. He's an extremely <laughs> funny man, originally from Canada. Clue number two. His catchphrase is... Alrighty then. Hmm. That rings a bell, pero... ¿Sabes? El problema es que aquí vemos todo doblado al yeah. español. Bueno, yeah. no anymore. Not the super motivated English students de amigos ingleses, ni yo, pero claro, hace años, pues a saber qué frase diría este hombre. I don't know. I think I'm gonna get the last one. So I'm gonna ah. ask the audience. Who are you gonna ask? You're gonna ask them? Pues claro, a los estudiantes de amigos ingleses. Así que dime en los comentarios de qué actor se trata. He oído que vas a sortear una clase de una hora en Cambly. Entonces yo creo que igual lo que podemos hacer es que quien adivine el nombre del actor, uno de vosotros se puede llevar la clase de una hora. ¿Qué te parece? That's a great idea. So write your answers in the comments below. We're thinking of an actor, very funny guy from Canada, and his catchphrase is Alrighty then. Okay then students, that's everything for today. Thanks for watching. We hope you found this useful. Now remember, don't forget to get... Isabel, yes. the 60 minute class is not for you, it's for them, okay? Ah. You know the mm. rules. Right, I thought maybe you had changed the rules. Okay, what about the 20 minute class? Don't forget, you get 20 minutes for free usando el código Amigos Ingleses 2019. ¿Cómo, cómo se consigue, Isabel? Oh, es muy fácil, mira. Entras en tu móvil a la app de Cambly o si prefieres en tu ordenador y haces clic en menú y vas a ver una casilla que pone referral code y ahí simplemente escribes Amigos Ingleses 2019 and Voilà, allí tienes tus 20 minutos de crédito, puedes usarlos ahora mismo o si prefieres, si tienes varias preguntas, qué hacer al profesor, varias dudas, puedes reservar la clase cuando a ti te vaya mejor. Yes. All right? And remember, there's nothing better than practicing your English speaking skills with a native teacher. This is absolutely essential for any student that wants to improve their English. You must practice your speaking. You hit the nail on the head. Speaking is essential. In the beginning you feel a bit clumsy and then you might still feel a bit clumsy but it gets better every time. So don't be shy, jump in the deep end, choose a teacher on Cambly and have a nice conversation. They're all very, very friendly people and we're sure you're gonna enjoy it. Thousands of our students have already had their 20 minutes and practiced their speaking and they've given us some great feedback and they absolutely love the platform. We think it's great as well. So go ahead and try it and enjoy. Yeah, and let us know as well in the comments, okay? Type the name of that actor. Y nada, pues nos vemos la semana que viene. Te traeremos mucho más inglés desde Amigos Ingleses. All right, take care. Bye-bye. Bye, students. Bye. Bye. Bye, students.